In a lush, expansive forest, there lived a solitary bear known for his immense size and strength. His presence was so intimidating that every creature in the forest would hastily retreat at his approach. The bear had grown used to this lonely existence, his only companions being the tall trees and the rustling weeds. One serene morning, as the bear ambled through the forest, his keen eyes caught sight of something unusual nestled among the ferns. Curious, he lumbered over and discovered a small, delicate egg lying alone on the forest floor. Now, what do we have here? He pondered, gently nudging the egg with his paw. An egg? But from what creature? Despite his curiosity, the bear felt a surge of protectiveness towards the vulnerable egg. Well, I may not know what's inside, but I'll ensure it stays safe, he decided, settling down beside it. Over the following days, the bear dedicated himself to the care of the mysterious egg. He constructed a protective nest from leaves and twigs, and often found himself talking to the egg during the long forest nights. I wonder what you'll turn out to be. Whatever you are, I'll be here for you, he would say softly. The forest was abuzz with rumors about the bear's unusual behavior. He's caring for an egg, said the squirrels. But what kind is it? wondered the birds. The bear, however, paid no heed to the whispers, focused solely on his task of guardianship. Finally, one crisp dawn, as the first rays of sunlight pierced the canopy, the egg began to crack. The bear watched, his heart filled with anticipation. Slowly, the shell fell away, revealing a tiny duckling, its downy feathers sticking out in all directions. Quack, the little duckling peeped, looking up at the bear with wide, innocent eyes. The bear was taken aback, a mix of surprise and delight washing over him. So, you're a duckling, he exclaimed with a gentle rumble. I never would have guessed. The bear's days were transformed with the duckling's arrival. He taught the little bird how to find the juiciest berries and the best drinking spots in the forest. He watched with pride as the duckling took her first clumsy steps, then her first hesitant swim in the forest stream. Their unusual friendship did not go unnoticed. The other forest animals, initially skeptical, soon came to admire the bear's tender care for the little duckling. He's not just strong, he's kind-hearted, they would say, watching them play by the water's edge. One day, a cunning fox, attracted by the duckling's chirps, stealthily approached. The duckling, sensing danger, quacked loudly. The bear, hearing her distressed call, charged through the underbrush, roaring fiercely. The fox, seeing the imposing bear approaching, scampered away in sheer terror. The bear gently wrapped his large, warm arms around the frightened duckling, offering her a comforting embrace. You're safe now. As long as I'm here, no harm will come to you. Years passed, and the forest grew to love the sight of the bear and his duckling, now a graceful, fully grown duck. They were inseparable companions, a testament to the unlikely bonds that can form in the wildest of places. 
As the sun set over the forest, casting a golden glow through the trees, the bear and the now-grown duck sat by the serene river, reflecting on their journey together. From the unexpected beginnings to the countless adventures, their bond had only grown stronger with time. In the tranquil silence of the forest, they understood that their friendship was a rare treasure, a testament to the enduring power of kindness and companionship. With a contented sigh, the bear knew that their story was one that would be whispered in the forest for generations to come. Goodbye, little one.